In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to link one JIRA ticket to another, providing a smooth way to associate related tasks or issues within your project management process. Linking tickets in JIRA is an excellent method for maintaining organization and ensuring that your team stays informed on how various components of your project are interrelated. This process, while straightforward, can significantly enhance your team's productivity once you get the hang of it. So let's dive in. First things first, you'll want to navigate to the specific project you're working on. Once you're there, you'll need to locate the top navigation bar where you'll see the Issues tab. Give that a click to reveal a plethora of issues associated with your project. If you're dealing with numerous tickets, this might feel a bit overwhelming at first, but don't worry, Jira's interface is designed to help you locate the tickets efficiently. Next, identify and open the specific Jira ticket that you wish to link to another. This action will bring up the detailed view of your selected issue, providing you with a closer look at all the details and relevant information. Now you're going to look just beneath the issue's name where you will see an option labeled add content in the details view. Clicking this will allow you to expand further functionalities such as linking issues. Now it's important to determine the type of relationship you want to establish between the two issues. Jira provides several predefined relationship types such as is blocked by, relates to or duplicate of. Choosing the correct type of link is crucial as it defines how the issues correlate. Take a moment to think about the nature of their connection to select the most appropriate option. After that, in the field provided, you'll want to enter the issue key of the ticket you're linking to. This is typically a combination of letters and numbers such as ABC123. If you don't have the exact key, you can enter part of the summary instead, which will allow Jira to perform a quick search through your project issues to find a match. This makes the task considerably easier if you lack specific details at hand. Upon locating the appropriate issue, simply select it. A quick but crucial final step is clicking on link to establish the connection officially. This straightforward action completes the linking process, instantly updating your tickets with the new relational information. With this link in place, anyone viewing these issues will have a clear understanding of their association, contributing to better comprehension and alignment as the project progresses. That's it, simple right? Now, you're equipped to efficiently link JIRA tickets, fostering greater transparency and improved project management for your team. I hope this guide has been helpful, thank you for watching, and until next time keep those projects moving forward smoothly.